Why, hello. My, aren't you a gorgeous sight? Can I be honored enough to know your name? Mmm, a lovely name for a lovely person like you. Wonderful. Eric, do your job. Very well. <clears throat> this game was produced by Seraphim Entertainment under the direction of Michaela Laws and is powered by Renpai Visual Novel Engine. We truly hope you'll enjoy this story. I know I'll enjoy it since you'll be in it. Eric. Fine, fine. <laughs> Farewell, my sweet. <laughs> Come on! Is that all you got? Wanna try me, asshole? Crap! Missed! Let's retreat for now! N no kidding! Let's get out of here! That's right! You better run, you stupid punks! Stay out of our territory! This formula, created in the 70s, is one of the most important in the field of financial theory. It is used to calculate the price of European-style options and is widely used by option marketers, though there are some discrepancies that are now corrected with the modern viewpoint. Miss Anderson. Would you care to name the equation I set up on the blackboard? Very good as always, Miss Anderson. Kick ass, girl. <clears throat> she means good job. Miss Capini. Oi! Care to tell me who the creators of this formula were? Uh, some guys named Black and Shoals. <clears throat> Fisher Black and Myron Shoals. Very good, Miss Patterson. Show off. Better study next time, Suzu. Be like us and study once in a while. That's the end of today's lecture. Now, let's separate into groups and work on your projects. Remember, everything is due on Monday. Go ahead now. How about a company name? Huh? Did we really skip over that? Of course we did! You always go straight into the logical statistics and stuff that you completely skip over the fact we need a name for our project. Ugh, at least we caught it this time. What do we name it? Hmm, not sure. What do you think?
I like Trinity Corporations. That is way too predictable. How about the Dragon Company? What do dragons have to do with our project? What? It's a totally unpredictable name. It's hot. But our company sells bubble gum. Who said we can't produce spicy bubble gum? <sighs> what do you think? Yeah, what do you think? Dragon Company it is! Alright, now that we've decided on a name, now what? <laughs> Ignore it, it's just Lisette. Probably is, but she's too much of a stuck-up priest to allow herself to look like she's actually doing work. Oh, come on, Suzu. She may be a little off-putting, but she's not the giant priest that you're making her seem to be. The day she isn't a priest is the day I turn into you. What's that supposed to mean? Never mind. It's about time! Let's bail! Sita isn't even closest to the exit, and she always manages to be the first one out of the door. I don't think I'll ever understand that. Oh, not you, too! She's turning you into a delinquent! It's not really funny. Man, you guys are slow. Are you coming or what? We heard you the first time. Not everyone has rocket boosters attached to their legs when the bell rings. Are you kidding me? That class was ridiculously boring. Even Miss Valedictorian here was dozing off a bit. Okay, so it wasn't too interesting. But you should at least pay attention when Phillips is talking about the important parts. So you finally admit it! We're finally on the same wavelength. Welcome to the club, Patterson. Please, don't call me by my last name. This isn't the classroom. And never in a million years will we ever see things eye to eye. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so where are we heading to first? Cafeteria? I think we can all agree that we're really hungry, especially after hearing about our company's line of deliciously spicy bubblegum. Who would even buy that? I wonder. Me? I would pay good money to get a taste of it. Cajun fries and the spicy chicken burger for me. That's my definition of a good meal. I'll take a tuna sandwich and some juice. You're probably going to need water or something to curb all that spicy flavor, Suzu. I can't be tamed by the likes of that. If it's spicy, then it's gotta be all or nothing. You're crazy! Hell yeah, I'm crazy. I think I'm getting a migraine. talk about <laughs> bored already I know let's talk about say boys and I will never speak to you ever again oh why not what's so interesting about talking about guys not like any of us are gonna get boyfriends anytime soon we don't know that what if one of us does get a boyfriend like that's going to happen Naomi look at us I'm a tiny Italian you're a ditzy blonde no offense. And Anderson here. 
Well, I guess she could land a boyfriend or girlfriend if she wants. Or girlfriend? She can be a lesbian if she wants. True. Why not? It's her senior year. Might as well get a boyfriend. Maybe she's just not interested in a relationship, Suzu. Miss Anderson, please come to the main office immediately. Please bring your things with you. Oh my. Looks like our plans have been cut short. The men in white coats have finally come to get you. <laughs> Suzu, don't joke around. What if it's serious? Ah, fine. If something happens, just call us. And now, I shall read Harold Anderson's last will and testament. And to my dearest granddaughter, I give my estate. All the furniture and decor that resides within the house shall also be given to my granddaughter. He passed the family estate to her? Why am I not surprised? Dear. Well, did he say anything about what will become of the CEO and chairman position of the Anderson Toys Company? No. It is presumed that the vice chairman will succeed the position. Heh. <laughs> Even to the bitter end, he wouldn't give in. What a stubborn old man. About the estate. Should we send her there to get used to the building? It'll be a good place for her to live after high school. Are you sure we should? Why not? This would be a good experience for her. Honey, what do you think? Well, that seems to be it. We'll be taking our leave now. I'm sure the little heiress needs some time to adjust. David! Don't mind him, honey. I think that your grandfather's passing really affected him. Why don't we get back home for now? Oh, of course. Take all the time you need. It's so good to see you again, sweetie. Is that so? Well, that's okay. Daddy can come around next time. And you're here, right? Oh, 
Oh, I would love to. But I've been so busy with the company these days. We're actually working on a little something. Would you like to see?